there she is the official repo shop we got some new equipment garrett's already there and of course he's working on our old junker all right let's pull in here she looks good shut the door garrett garrett you're still working on that 550 huh i thought you got that fixed man i keep fixing it and then it just breaks again i i think you're driving it like a crazy man yeah and you know what i could be that could be the problem you're right yeah well, either way man do you see this new equipment we got because that's way more important heck yeah let's let's walk through it let's explain what everything is but this is the 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 tlx phoenix tow truck pack there was a crazy update bunch of cool stuff and we're gonna be pretty much just using this stuff for towing repoing and just beating the crap out of it yes sir we will be very good very good let's walk through it for you know what let's let's grab the truck i'll back in gary you get me hooked up and we we have a repo that we're probably hopefully can use this equipment on because it wasn't cheap oh i'm hoping man this stuff was a pretty penny chow really needs us to get our money's worth one of the coolest things on here let's uh let's go through it but check out the back garrett when i'm backing in watch this oh you see that, that is so cool yeah yeah the so lights. it's like the the day cab lights and then the phoenix on the back it does get covered up a little bit sometimes but uh but it looks really really cool let's go ahead and we'll get to what is this the tow rig yes sir that is there you go good alignment keep going back in looks good all right should be on there let me just double check yep we're good all right guys so this is the typical tow truck what you've seen what you're used to but the cool thing is you can detach and reattach then do other service beds so you have a flat bed here and then i get the service bed it actually has a crane you can lift up cars you can lift up garrett even i know he's pretty heavy sometimes but when you're lifting up garrett make sure to put out the support oh yeah also i'll tip you over man that's right i'll show you let's drop down the supports if i can there's a lot of buttons on the inside here it's kind of hard to figure out but let's detach this we'll put on a new bed and the yeah this is the original bed but now technically you can detach from it there we go very cool that has support all right garrett let's get to the flat bed here this one's simple but it's perfect for a towing setup oh yeah this thing's gonna be exactly what we need there you go a little further nice very good that's clean and it has the my favorite is like the toolbox in the front the 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 rack and stuff that you have the light bar on so then it's it's built into the the bed as well awesome toolboxes let's unfold the ramps in the back there they go oh yeah and i'm gonna get chaz lambo let's drive that on there <laughs> yeah load up the lambo that would be perfect all right pull around yeah back her in that should uh minimize the scraping i don't think it's it, the undercarriage is gonna scrape for sure oh yeah this is a very steep one but we're loading up a okay. lamborghini there, there we, we go. go yeah yeah yeah. that works perfect man there we are it's because i'm such a good driver okay well pull her back off i was thinking about load Ugh, this might be too wide it's not it's not that big of a service bed but it's super heavy duty oh yeah that can hold so much weight there we go let's fold up the ramps i'm gonna detach and then my favorite is the uh is the crane or the service bed or whatever you want to call it garrett's really good at running it it's kind of hard there's so many different attachments and stuff but i tell you what Garrett, i'm gonna leave the flatbed on mine let's just check out the service bed on yours all right let's do it man so this and is just garrett's personal setup he went with the red i went with the orange but what, what were you saying man i was just gonna say that these are available not only on pc but on consoles as well and honestly if you're on pc i'd recommend using this one with a controller um but yeah you guys can get this on whatever platform you play on yeah i'm on keyboard as you guys can tell i'm kind of robotic with my movements i just prefer it uh but then yeah like garrett said he's on He's on his Xbox controller, so it works out pretty good. We actually have a job. We need to get going here soon once Garrett's done demonstrating. I want to make sure it works. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Let's move this arm out. Very cool. Don't hit Just the like ceiling, that. man. Oh, don't worry. I got this. I got this. All right, so it opens up like a claw machine. That's pretty cool. Oh, yeah. And we can obviously bring this out pretty far. Dang. Check that out. Dang. Yeah, yeah. That's it. Oh, my. It's still going. Dang. Oh, yeah. That's why we got the supports on here. And then course you can lower on down as well very cool and then it just you have four anchor points or four hooks that you can hook on to anything but we actually yep. have a call we need to use this on uh, we need to quit talking we actually have to make some money and get to work but there's a there's a sunken boat that we have to rescue it almost made it to the shore but it's taking on too much water and and they need something to get it out so this might be the easiest way let's do it garrett 
Let's do it, man. This should be perfect. Hopefully it's not too big a belt. I'm thinking we'll put it on the flatbed here and then Garrett's gonna use the crane, lift it up and out of the water and we'll see how it goes pretty much. Here come Garrett and I, see if he can make the turn. Pressure's on, looks good. But these are some big rigs heading down the road. It's, uh, they sound good, they run good. They honk good. They do honk good. Get on her. Move or lose it, sister. There we are. We don't need stop signs when you here's, got a here's train, a train Here's a train up here. Let's honk at him. Oh, yeah. Move I it. bet you'll hear it. There we, there go. we go. I, I told you the main the train would move for us. Perfect. Man, you did all the work there. Good job. Good oh, job. come on. These things. Oh, now are, you're struggling. Yeah, I know. I don't want to bust. Okay, there we go. Imagine if it just, like, picked up your vehicle. Now nah, you'd probably snap it before that would happen. Yeah, I think I would, Gear. Those are, like, two by fours. But where, where are we going? <laughs> Straight ahead? Yeah, straight ahead, just keep on going. We should see a boat across the water. Just follow along the road. There we yeah, go. But left quick there. shout out to 82 Studios for making this pretty like crazy mod. Not gonna lie, it's like one of the most like dynamic mods in Farm Sim. There's just so much going on. It's uh, it's crazy. I don't think we've ever had a mod with as many controls as these have, and customization options and just features. It, it's it's mind blowing that anyone could make this. Yeah, I don't even think we're using half the capability of what these can probably do and what they're made for. But heck, today we're gonna be pulling a boat out of the water, so we're we're using them for something. There she is, oh, right yeah. to the right, Garrett. There we go. Yeah, that thing is definitely taking on water real quick. Why don't you uh, Why don't you back in first? I'm thinking, get you in position, then I can come through. Okay, sounds good. Yep, it's just that first turn. Don't hit the light post or the mailboxes. Yeah, I hope I will make this. Oh, I might have to. Ooh. Oh, yeah. There we go. There Looks we like go. Looks like the big storm took down a tree here. Oh, it did. That storm a few weeks back was crazy. Remember That's... all the flooding? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is. I'm surprised they don't have it cleaned up yet. But what the story is on this boat is it was taken on water. He, he said he hit a log or something in the water. It could have been a rock, too. Just a shallow spot. Cracked his hole, was taken on water, realized it, and he started just flying back to... Uh, Back to the shore and he just ran into ground and pretty much that's where it's at he can't really get it out yeah that thing is definitely needing our help <laughs> all right do you think i should position kind of on the concrete so i can swing around and drop it on I the bed th or? i think they'll be i think they'll be safest because out here it's a little uneven and let's get you in, into position and then kind of one step at a time man yeah it's gonna make sure there's enough room for these supports all right you look good from here all right, let's hope this arm can reach. Yeah, it's pretty it, far. Yeah, that's the only question. Can it reach? So I'm checking out the boat here, Garrett, looking at some places we can lift from. And there's some anchor tie down spots on the side, but this thing is full of water. So it's going to be an extra. It's going to be quite a bit more heavy because there's, think about it, half it's just filled with water. Man, we might need to give you a little bucket and you just have to start dumping some out. Yeah, just start. Uh, I, I Yeah, I use like, no, I'm not going to do that. All right, well, it's an option. All right, extend it anything out. Let's see what we can do, man. Here we go. That's as far as I'm going. All right, lower her down. You got anything? All right, drop her down. All right, here we go. The waves are kind of picking up. They're moving the boat around a bit. Oh, yeah. They definitely are moving All right, All right, uh, here we go. We got one anchor, two, and go right. ahead. Yep, looks good. There we go. We got something gripped on. All right, I, uh, yeah, I, I kind of had to go around this railing in the front, and then in the back, there's an anchor point, so... Garrett, go ahead, lift up. Just get her in the air. Let's see what we can do. We can't make it any worse. Oh, I'm worried about that back corner. Still don't want to scratch it up. Oh, screw but. it. Come on, man. When you lift this thing up, there's going to be a huge hole in the middle. Okay, here we go. Let's see how strong these ropes are. Oh, it's heavy. All right, that looks good, Garrett. Nice, nice, nice. I think, uh, okay, I have no idea where I'm going to take my truck, but you know maybe what? Maybe on, you think? maybe go on like the left side of me. Can you swing around that way? All right, I'm getting pulled around, man. That thing's rocking a little bit. Are you sure you got it under control? I hope so. It's pretty what? windy and- What do you mean you hope so? Well, well, we're just gonna have to kind of see, you know? Sometimes you can't calculate everything. All right, I'm getting backed up here, man. This actually looks pretty solid. There you go, don't hit it, don't hit it. Go ahead, if you can twist it towards you, maybe. Okay, let me try. I know that's asking a lot. Here we go, here we go. That's getting better. 
All right, that looks good, Garrett. Go ahead and start dropping her. Okay, here we go. Lower down, lower down. I'll strap it down. Come on, baby. She's lowering. That looks good, man. Go ahead, detach. All right. I'll get you unstrapped. Oh, nice, nice. You already done? Yeah. Yeah, we have the automatic system, man. I just click a button. There we go. That's clean. That's clean. Look at that. Ooh, she's pretty, man. Wow, imagine trying to do this with the old equipment. I don't know what we would have done. We, uh, yeah, I, I have no idea how we would transport it. Because we can't really put it on a boat trailer. I mean, we were thinking about that, but we said, heck, let's put it on here. Oh, yeah. This is perfect. Yeah, no, no point to put that on a boat trailer. But now... Be very careful when you're driving, because obviously that thing's sticking out pretty far. Yeah, we'll take this back to the shop. Yeah, yeah, I think uh, a little over, th you know what? Probably half of the boat is sticking off the back of my truck. So when I swing, swing, when I turn, I got to turn pretty dang wide. This is pretty cool, though. This is, I would say this is our coolest load yet. Oh, yeah, man. I love how that looks. Look at you go. Oh, that's cool. So, so we're thinking I'll be driving behind you just to kind of keep the road clear. Yeah, make sure nobody does anything crazy. I gotta make this turn. There you go, nice and wide. Yeah, check all your blind spots, man. There we go. So another rescue in the books, but this one was a boat rescue. Pretty crazy that the guy actually got to the shore. And uh, and they would have had, it, it's really expensive. Like if you lose a boat, like, and it sinks all the way to the bottom, they gotta use this crazy like dredge boat and it reaches down and cables and everything. But we got it out and it should be a bit cheaper for him. So. Good work, Garrett. Did you like the like the new trucks? I definitely do like Watch it. Watch out, we got a train. Oh no, it's a oh geez. We're okay. good. There we go. There we go. Yeah, no, I like this equipment quite a bit. Obviously, it's way more advanced than what we were previously using. So, gotta still learn everything and find the best ways to tackle each scene we arrive to. For sure. Well, if you guys want to check out these trucks, I'll have it linked in the description. Like Garrett said earlier, they're both for PC and console. There might be some limitations on console. Honestly, I've, I really have no idea, but check it out, guys. If you enjoyed the video as well, smash the like button and subscribe if you haven't already. I'll see you in the next one.